Do you ever feel like your life is being controlled by a dopamine addiction? You're not alone. Dopamine addiction can be a powerful force that affects our decisions, emotions, and behaviors in ways we don't even realize. It's hard to break free from the cycle of addiction without the right tools and strategies. I'll show you how to reclaim control of your life from dopamine addiction in this video. We'll look at the science behind it, talk about ways to lessen the effect it has on your daily life, and give you ways to stop being addicted to dopamine so you can get back to living a healthier life. By the end of this video, you will have the knowledge and strategies to break free from dopamine addiction and get back to living a healthier life. So, let's begin! What is dopamine? Dopamine is a neurotransmitter, which is a chemical released by the brain's neurons that allows cells in the brain to communicate with each other. It plays an important role in motivating us to pursue rewards and creating feelings of pleasure. This can lead to dopamine addiction when people become dependent on activities or substances that trigger dopamine release in order to feel good. For example, some people may become addicted to gambling, drugs, or food because of the dopamine rush they get from these activities. Other activities like social media use and shopping can also increase dopamine levels and lead to addiction if done excessively or too often. There are many ways for our brains to develop an unhealthy dependence on dopamine. So, it's important for us all to be aware of how this can happen and learn strategies for staying healthy. The Science Behind Dopamine Addiction The science behind dopamine addiction is complex, but it can be broken down into several components that include neurochemical processes in the brain. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter involved in reward-seeking behavior and is responsible for producing feelings of pleasure, motivation, and focus. Dopamine is made in the brain when people do or experience things that are pleasurable. This release of dopamine is what makes these activities feel good, and people may keep doing them or use them too much because they want to feel this good feeling again and again. There are several pathways through which dopamine is released in the brain, including dopaminergic projections from the ventral tegmental area to subcortical regions such as the nucleus accumbens and amygdala, as well as dopaminergic projections from cortical regions such as the prefrontal cortex to subcortical structures like the VTA. It has been suggested that when individuals engage in an activity that releases dopamine, such as gambling or using drugs, this triggers a positive feedback loop where neurons become sensitized to further stimulation, leading to an increase in dopamine release that may contribute to addiction. Additionally, changes in glutamate transmission may have been linked to problems with impulse control and substance abuse disorders and may contribute to addictive behaviors. Given that there are so many different pathways involved in dopamine release, it's important for us to be aware of our own behaviors and how they might impact our brain's chemistry. Understanding how our brains react differently to different environments or substances can help us understand our own patterns of behavior and give us ways to control ourselves when we do things or use things that could be addictive. Warning Signs of Dopamine Addiction Some common warning signs of dopamine addiction are having an uncontrollable urge to do the activity or use the substance that releases dopamine, having trouble doing daily tasks without doing the activity or using the substance, becoming more tolerant of the activity or substance and needing more of it get the same effects. 
and having withdrawal symptoms like irritability and anxiety when not doing the addictive activity. Other psychological symptoms associated with dopamine addiction may include restlessness, insomnia, racing thoughts, compulsive behavior, and mood swings. It's also important to recognize physical symptoms such as changes in appetite, weight fluctuations, and fatigue. Not everyone will experience all of these signs of dopamine addiction, but if any are present, it's important to take action to address them before the problem worsens. How to reduce the impact of dopamine addiction Tools and strategies for reducing the impact of dopamine addiction on your life can include making lifestyle changes, such as getting regular exercise, eating a nutritious diet, getting enough sleep, and managing stress levels. These activities can help to increase serotonin production in the brain, which has been linked to improve moods and decrease impulsivity. Additionally, finding other healthy and enjoyable activities that you can do instead of engaging in compulsive behaviors can provide an alternative source of pleasure or reward that doesn't involve dopamine-releasing activities. It's also important to be mindful of triggers and environments that may encourage addictive behaviors and limit exposure to these if possible. Other strategies may include setting limits on certain activities like gambling or social media use and seeking professional help from a therapist or counselor who is knowledgeable about addiction if needed. Cognitive behavioral therapy is often effective at helping people identify unhealthy patterns of behavior and providing healthier alternatives for dealing with stressors or difficult emotions. Finally, developing healthy coping skills such as journaling, talking with trusted friends or family members about concerns or worries, engaging in relaxation techniques like yoga or meditation, or taking time out for yourself can all be helpful in managing dopamine addiction more effectively. Practical Tips for Breaking Free from Dopamine Addiction Practical tips for breaking free from dopamine addiction can include establishing a regular eating routine, minimizing processed and sugary foods, increasing water intake, and incorporating more natural and nutritious whole foods into the diet. Regular exercise is another key important of recovery as physical activity can help to boost serotonin levels, reduce stress levels, and improve overall well-being. The type of exercise chosen should be enjoyable and something that can become part of a daily routine, such as going for a walk or bike ride. Additionally, spending time in nature has been shown to lower levels of cortisol while improving moods. It's also important to limit exposure to triggers. For example, if gambling is an issue, then avoiding casinos or online gambling sites could be helpful. Resources available for dealing with dopamine addiction When it comes to resources available for dealing with dopamine addiction, therapy and support groups can be extremely helpful. Therapy can provide individuals with an opportunity to explore underlying causes of their addiction and gain insight into how their thoughts and beliefs are impacting their behavior. A therapist can also help to identify any co-occurring mental health conditions that may need to be addressed in order to more effectively manage the addiction. Support groups such as 12-step programs or smart recovery can offer a safe place for those struggling with dopamine addiction to connect with others who are in similar situations and receive guidance from those who have been through similar experiences. These types of programs often provide tools for coping with cravings, managing stress, and avoiding relapse triggers. In addition, medication can be beneficial for some individuals who are struggling with dopamine addiction, as certain medications have been shown to reduce compulsive behaviors while also regulating levels of dopamine in the brain. It's important to have regular check-ins with the doctor when taking these medications 
and weigh risks against benefits before starting any new drug regimen. Finally, holistic approaches such as mindfulness, meditation, or yoga can be extremely helpful in dealing with dopamine addiction, as they involve activities that promote relaxation, regulation of emotional states, and improve self-awareness. Taking back control of one's life from dopamine addiction can be a long and daunting process, but it is possible. Developing healthy habits such as eating nutritiously, exercising regularly, and engaging in relaxation techniques are essential for recovery. Creating boundaries around activities like media use or gambling can help to minimize exposure to triggers that could lead to relapse. Finally, exploring therapy and support groups can provide the additional guidance and insight needed to develop a personalized recovery plan. With the help of these tools, you can reclaim your life from dopamine addiction and live without its hold over you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you all next time!